Okay, so here's my quick review of a Audi S4. This is a tuned S4, so it's not stock, and so that changes obviously a lot of factors in the way the car handles. This car has lowering springs, but the same dampers that come with the vehicle stock. It has a chip or a tune and transmission tune by APR. It produces about 445 crank horsepower. Of course, that would be less to the wheels. The handling is excellent overall. Not a ton of feel. Feels feels very sure-footed. Feels very solid, but not a lot of on-center feel. Excellent weighting, uh, as in steering weight, as as you turn and as you turn more, the vehicle feels like it wants to keep doing that. It wants to keep rotating. You do turn it wants to do even more so that's that's a pretty awesome feature of course, even stock is excellent this one with 445 horsepower at sea level this is in Colorado so that's probably a bit less plenty of power obviously 0 to 60 is around four and a half seconds if you just stomp it from a start brakes are extremely strong Way more than you ever really need on the, on the road. And if you're trying to drive in a aggressive manner, they're 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 amazing brakes. The fit and finish, of course, is it's an Audi, and it has excellent fit and finish. Everything is soft touch where it should be. Wherever you're touching, wherever your elbows rest, uh, excellent fit and finish. Carbon fiber trim, and then chrome or soft soft kind of a silver plastic trim around the rest of the interior. So excellent fit and finish. The ride on the highway is tolerable. It's a little stiff, so maybe not the best long drive cruising car, but really nice ride overall, compromise between sport and, and comfort. A little on the stiff side. The wind noise is non-existent, very little tire noise, and these are ultra high performance mud and snow tires. These are not even all season tires, but still very little tire noise, very little wind noise, very subdued. And um, seat comfort is excellent. There's adjustable uh, thigh support, really soft, smooth leather wherever, wherever you're touching basically. Transmission, it shifts pretty quickly. I don't think this is a dual clutch unit. I think it would shift more quickly if it was a dual clutch unit. But uh, very, very nice transmission, very, uh, very responsive. Overall, I would, uh, would say this is a really, really good compromise for a daily driver. And uh, if you can get that tune as well, you can really surprise some people, I'm sure, in stoplight drag races with the all-wheel drive system as well. There's very little loss of traction. So really nice car overall. Definitely would recommend if you can get your hands on one to drive it definitely do that.